Hi everyone. Welcome to the Monday meeting. Let us just settle in our spaces and connect together, creating a holographic space, a shared, unified space. Just let your energies be drawn back first into the body connect with your breath You can make an intention to draw all of the energies back from all timelines, all spaces, all lifetimes, back into the sacred heart space. And you can even see and visualize all of the holographic fluctuations, all of the hijack timelines coming back, back into the heart space. So let's just inhale and call it all back. And as you exhale, you're just situating yourself deeper in your sacred heart. Welcome everyone and let us make an intention to create a safe group field whereby we can get access to quantum technologies that teach us a new potentiality which is here now but may not be unearthed. So let us create this safe space, connect to our guides, our higher selves, our I am presence, to the Christ it's Sophia consciousness, to our soul, to the soul monad, and the one mother, father, God. I ask dear mother father god to open all channels of light these are just all different emanations of your multi-dimensional being deepening connecting I also call forth our 12 dimensional shield of protection for the group field as well as for our individual field. And 
And as we are taking our places in a virtual holographic circle, I call forth a creational vortex of healing, of teaching, of transformation and transfiguration now, and so it is. And I also ask for all the information that we receive here today in this shared space due to our shared connection to our guides, higher self. I am present to be of the highest light. Wonderful. I'm just going to shortly make some notes as I usually do as they come through the field and then they will just apply the teaching, the healing, the being. What had occurred to me is that our current now, we're seeing an extreme polarity between arising between the 3D and the 5D. And this polarity is widening becoming more harsh and what I see maybe a glitch in many teachings is when we portray the fifth D as only love and light That is a dangerous teaching. There is a reason why we have ascended the planet in certain groups to help anchor the one unity consciousness of the Christ at Sophia unity grid. And we're here to hold the light. And as we hold the light, we hold both. We hold the extreme polarity. This awakening into the Christed consciousness unity consciousness is entraining us is entraining us to hold this extreme duality and this is where we are able to involve the way that's the only way not siding with either side today what I'd like to do is bring back all the hijack timelines here to the heart And all of us, there is a reason why only seasoned <laughs> practitioners 
attend these meetings. As a unified field, we can aid this timeline that we're going to create. Pull back all the hijacked negative timelines into the zero point. And then train this body-mind mechanism to hold the light, to hold the one truth that we embody through the light. And one more thing. As light beings, we are here for a reason, and we know that. But we do also have physical bodies. And these physical bodies, as mechanisms, fluctuate between all these modes of being, through all the timelines, dimensions. And for us, most of the time, it's hard to not be affected with extreme negative polarity. Hmm. And I have to share that it is just a matter of training. It's training. So let us train today. Hmm. Do not forget that you create your own hologram moment by moment. So in order to shift the collective consciousness, the teaching is that we're pulling all the hijacked timelines back into the zero point. What do I call the hijacked timelines? Timelines created by the collective consciousness through the events happening around us. And our vibratory accordance with these hijacked timelines. So you need to be vibratorily be pulled into these timelines. So it is constantly a choice between love and fear. And fear is everything. Yes, everything other than love. It's fear. It's anger. It's everything. So let us just deeply connect for a second, dropping back, slowing down into this body-mind mechanism, and then we'll go deeper and deeper into our sacred heart, into the zero-point field, and then we'll pull back all the hijacked tunnels. And once you are in taking part in your personal life, your society, wherever you're found, you can vibratorily adjust the quantum field into the zero point of unity consciousness. I'm just going to close the window. So settle back in, drop all of these words, drop them, there are three methods 
using the pranic channel of your spine. The third eye and the heart, these are our tools. So as you're dropping, have a whole body consciousness from your toes to the head, from the head to the toes. You're pulling back your attention and focus to the spine. There's this beautiful, subtle pull to the back body. As you've noticed, our sessions are very advanced quantum teaching to actually embody the light through this body-mind vessel. That's the only way. I ask this vessel's personal ego to be taking the back seat and only the highest information, highest love and light can be delivered here among us. And so it is. I now strengthen this portal, this vortex energy portal that we have opened and also make an intention because it's a group work. open this energy portal in this circle I ask dear mother father God to seal this portal from all sides Seal it into the light and into the highest vibration. And through the presence of our higher selves, which are equated with our souls, through the presence of our galactic brothers and sisters who serve the light, Be allowed this teaching to unravel here and now. You can connect your heart space, the back of your spine. And I will now open the channel of clearing so that our body vessels and the spaces where we are found are fully cleansed to open ourselves to the downloads that we are going to receive we're already receiving them Picture Metatron's cube as the circles are connected and the circles represent our hearts and we're all connected in this blessed space, forming a crystalline grid, serving the highest good of all. Make sure that you're connected to your breath in a very natural way, full body consciousness. 
And now quickly we're going to extend our pranic channel all the way from our heart to the central sun. And from the central sun back into the heart. So this pranic channel pierces through our soul star, the galactic star, in the central sun. And then from the back side of the heart we move downwards into the root. From the heart, make note of your root. Very good. Make note of the root. More and more, deeper and deeper, the root chakra. And just see how this pranic channel is entering your soul star from the soul star, which is beyond your head, 15 centimeter, centimeters beyond your head. And then it's connected to your heart. It's corrected, fully connected with your earth star chakra. This vessel has hardships talking because the energy is very high vibration. And we connect to our earth star chakra. And automatically we create a connection to the unified earth grid, crystalline earth grid of new earth. And deeper we connect to the center of this planet. to this luminous dodecahedron golden white light and I'm now going to I means not one it's a conglomeration of being All of you are asked to apply your might and presence to have a much more connected flow within this pranic channel connecting you fully as above so below and so it is and move your consciousness awareness to the back side of the heart and see this first chamber Still this energetic plane, the first chamber. Now easing all of the energies around you, all of the energies around us in this holographic field. Being pulled back into this wonderful first chamber. Oh. You can make an intention that I allow and I am open for the highest good of all. Allowing the neutralization of all the energy in this space.
as a tool, connect your third eye consciousness. with your medulla oblongata in the back side of your brain, back side of your head. And then just drop back down into the heart. The space becomes this quantum suctioning space, a vortex. This vortex moves left, right, up and down at the same time, activating your light body. Beautiful. And if your mind starts showing you this dress that you cannot see or feel, just let it go. Because your cells know, they know. The Merkaba mechanism had started to spin fast in the middle of your chest and just see, visualize how your heart field is spreading, 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 360 degrees, beautifully spreading. Engulfing your body, engulfing your space, the Merkaba in the shape of two three-dimensional triangles are spinning, creating a spheric form. And as you're spreading your Merkaba, you're engulfing the city, the houses, the people, the country, the earth, and I'm just going to make a command to spread to infinity, fully protected. And now just drop back into the back side of the heart. We have such blessed teachers present today. Thank you. Thank you. Backside of the heart. See your third eye illuminated. And right now I'm just going to blow through it a little bit so that all of the saturated densities are just blown out very simply. Very good. And connect to your heart and spine at the same time. Heart, third eye, spine. Have full consciousness. We have multi dimensional consciousness. And as we are drawing all the energies in, what are we doing? We are slowing down the field so that we move beyond speed. Moving beyond speed means we got to the fastest point and we move beyond speed. Drawing back all of it into this first chamber. Inhale through the root chakra. Inhale. Push up the energy through your spine, out your crown, and with this silent ha, let it go. Let 
Letting go all of the tensions present in the body. I ask our body, the body consciousness to be at ease. It's at ease. It is the, in this balmy environment. This environment is helping your nervous system recover, optimize, heal. I am asking this white cleansing diamond light to descend into our crown, descend into the nervous system, the glandular system. I ask for the harmonization of all the bodies, the physical, the mental, the emotional, the astral, the etheric bodies. Harmonize now. This is just a stronger command. Anamaya Kosh. Pranamaya Kosh. I'm just calling back all the bodies into alignment. Vidyana Mayako Ananda Mayako Prana Mayako Slowing down the energy Our nervous systems are being filled with this healing light blue electric light coupled with the luminosity of the sun now. You're going to detect it in your third eye and then move on. You're doing the same job as I am, so spread it from your third eye into each cell. Electric, light blue light cursing through our veins, our blood. Moving the iron particles out, changing them into crystalline, plasmic, photonic light. Now, moving into the blood. Moving into the bone marrow, this is just the preparation for today's transmission. Hmm. Wonderful. Moving into the whole skeletal structure. And just Feel this blessed white crystalline consciousness descending and clearing in a form of a waterfall. Beautiful. Because you have no shape and form, hmm, just cleanse the areas around you, the people around you, the beautiful waters around you, the plants, the trees.
We are connected in one web of the living light. One web of the living light. And now, we're moving into the second chamber, the deepest chamber of our heart. Paths, energies, impressions, thoughts, emotions, feelings. past this immediate constrictive experience of the body you can explode an atom you can explode this constriction move back into the second deepest chamber of your heart back side of the body Pulling all the energies from the front body to the back. Wonderful. Let your nervous system relax. The muscles are relaxed in love and peace. We've created this atmosphere. We've laid down the grounds for expansion. And then slowly drop into the zero point field. The portal now is open. moving you down, down into slow stillness. Notice how the momentum of doing is still alive. The momentum of doing, achieving, is still alive, but it's in the foreground, it's just in the foreground. Wonderful. And everything is opening and allowed in this field of the zero point. In your body now, learn this, this is the mechanism. You receive and transmit through your heart at the same time. the help of your third eye, just tune into this multi-dimensional being. The body in the third dimension, which is connected to all dimensions, is a receiver and transmitter at the same time pulsating in and out of existence. 
if you want to try this get in touch with your pulse on the side of your lower arm just get in touch with your pulse Uh, harmonize your pulse with the Schumann resonance of the earth where you're found. Harmonize, harmonize, harmonize. This pulsation is also indicating that you're phasing in and out of reality 10,000 times per millisecond. Phasing in and out of reality, creating this illusion of continuity. And now as we are all situated in the zero point. We've just zoomed in. And it's a zoom in and out at the same time. See all of the energies. In front of you. almost like you're seeing a river of energies and you just step out you pull yourself out of the river and have this direct knowing that you are the river you're behind the river and you're all of it all of it the light of your being this lightless light is illuminating everything all of it It's illuminating the river, which are the energies. It's illuminating the source of energy. And it's also directing you to the direct knowing. Of your source self. This is where you collapse. All quantum potentiality moving beyond the zero point. Allow. Allow and feel this entrainment and the way you are entrained is that you allow this body mind and the energy field wider 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 energy field to do its job to do whatever it's doing and you're just unconditionally oh, feel this unconditionally and lovingly curiously allowing 
allowing all of it Deep, dropping, deep harmonization, entrainment, dear ones, this is the play. You can make a choice from, you can create a timeline of your choice, otherwise you're just playing into the pool of existent fragmented or hijacked timeline. That's all it is. This is how the matrix modulates. Hmm. Now you can ask this body mind mechanism to just evoke, notice, note, not place much attention but just bring it into your field of awareness to these timelines that are existing in your reality that are causing you distress or pain or instability that are wailing you from this beautiful spaciousness and love as being through being through you. And you can visualize them as being these channels, these portals, and they can be taking place around your body mind. as energetic fields. You can just see them, whether they're these timelines are running out from the body, energetic field, from the body outward. So are they around your solar plexus, around your heart, root, sacral? And you, it, they can be in the back body. Are they around your brain, creating these offshoots, offshoots of energy? Because this is what carries you in a particular hijack timeline so you then automatically create that reality each one of you can visualize this process differently You can see yourself as a porcupine and the little spikes on the porcupine are these hijacked timelines. I'm sharing a very powerful technology right now. Of course, of course these prickly thorns on a porcupine could be 
shorter or longer, depending on how long have you been feeding this timeline. can be there from many lifetimes ago, still there. It's interwoven with your ancestors' timeline. And now we're not going into details. We're not going into details. It's enough to just have these mental notes of these timelines. And now the body and its wider energy field as it's in itself a conduit of light going to become this hyperspatial quantum machine as you connect it to your zero point field and beyond. Visualize how you're projecting this infinite golden white light from your heart 360 degrees into these fragmented timelines if you don't see them you just project it from the heart as if you were projecting the sun's rays outward, 360 degrees outward. Oh, there's a still point, there's a still point where the light is still lightless and there it enters phenomenally enters into space from nothing light becomes light you can see this light swirled out swirling out into these timelines filling these hijacked channels with this light. For the highest good of all. It's reprogramming the vibratory field of this body-mind mechanism. But it's doing it hyper-dimensionally. Hyper so all of your dimensional existences are also harmonized and reprogrammed now. And your safest place, not that you're endangered, but your most powerful place to be, is that mm, space of emanation from where emanation takes place, from where all of the light is emanate. A 
as the Mahatattva, the mind of source. You step into that space because that is you. Mahatattva. And all you're doing is blessing all of these hijacked timelines. That's all you're doing. Okay, this is very, very powerful. Mm. You think, you can repeat it within yourself. I thank each of this timeline for the contrast. It had provided me, all of me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, thank you for all the teaching. And all of these fragmented timelines had served the purpose of you. Becoming the self, remembering, collapsing, all the timeline just collapsing collapsing the third dimensional matrix and all we can do is collapse it with gratitude I feel now the quantum field is melting out negations of what is so you can make an intention if you're ready that I am open and I'm willing to melt all the ways that I negate what is I allow to melt the ways I say no to what is. Wow, do you see that? <laughs> All the ways you negate what is. It's reinforcing the matrix. Okay, we need to oh, embrace, we can make this space together. This is why it's so powerful to do it together. We can also see more light flow through those areas of ourselves that negate and it's completely fine. Very good. It's like we are the most loving, merciful, unconditional mother. The teaching is that all, all is allowed. teaching of ascension is exactly this, moving beyond the river, moving beyond duality. Why? Because 
just for the sake of your third dimensional body, mind, avatar. Once you moved beyond contrast, You can make the most life-affirming choices for you and for humanity. See the body light up. See your body light up. It's a receiver and a transmitter at the same time. All of the nadis are cleared, restructured. Grace is flowing through your being, your veins, your body, your mind. See your brain lit up. As your brain is lit up, it's sending those codes of light into the body. It's your safe. You're safe and you're connected to yourself. Reprogramming the body-mind avatar now. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. See your root chakra light up 360 degrees. It's like the 10,000 suns vibrating, pulsating in your root, pulsating, phasing in and out of existence, pulsation of light. Just let it pulsate. Continue letting pulsate. Moving to the sacral. Pulsate. Move into the solar plexus, pulsate. See how your digestive organs are being recalibrated and returned, healed, returned to their original blueprint. I ask for the inner sun to be fully restored, fully restored, fully restored. You can say, I am sovereign, I am divine, I am free, I am light. This is the encoding through all the light codes in the solar plexus chakra now. You're still, all of this is still emanating from the formless. And then the heart space is already here, pulsating. It had open to infinity. The throat pulsating, opening, recalibrating. Third eye
the highest good of all. Your crown, wonderful, I now ask dear mother, father, God to seal this transmission, seal this transmission in all seven directions. I now close the group portal and seal it. And I ask that our cellular makeup is now fully able to utilize these light codes every single light code that had been received for the highest good of all be utilized brought down into the 3d M bodied fully now. So just feel all of this data, this high vibrational light data, open up in your energy field. not staying in a potentiality but it's embodied now drink water avoid dense food We're slowly dismantling the 3D matrix with love. Bring it all here and body as you open your eye. This is how you collapse timeline. for the highest good of all. Hmm. I ask this healing to be continued throughout the night. until tomorrow morning. I thank all the teachers present here today. Our shared holographic field, the presence of our higher selves, our souls, Christ is consciousness. I thank our galactic guides that serve the light. And direct us towards So, let our
personal will be aligned with the highest will. In every action, deed, word, utterance, heartbeat, breath, and so it is. Thank you everyone. See you soon. Sharing love. Hmm.